And now to continue with the opening uh, festivities here, there's certain charity partners uh, that we have for this event that are vital to us, as well as our commercial partners, the charity partners, the uh, Cure for Life Foundation and Barnardos Australia, uh, incredibly meaningful and important organisations for this country. And we as, as Australians owe a debt of gratitude to them. And I'd like to introduce now Sophie Lindgren, the uh, Chairman of the Glebe Chamber of Commerce, to express that gratitude. This, this is working? Yes, it is. Okay. First of all, welcome and thank you for coming to the Glebe Street Fair. And I'm here on the behalf of the Glebe Chamber of Commerce, all the businesses in the street who open up the road for this to happen today. Um, I want to give my uh, gratitude to all the sponsors that are here that come on board, both charities and sponsors, both from Glee and major sponsors. Uh, I want to special, there's especially a, a acknowledgement for, I'm so sorry about this, uh, for the City of Sydney and to our inspirational progressive Lord Mayor, Clover Moore. The city encourages the development of these strong uh, and healthy community and support uh, city events. And of course, uh, we're very touched again to um, uh, the Cure of Life Foundation and we want to give them a gratitude, our gratitude to them. So here, Theo, Charlie Theo. Yes. Yes. Um, uh, the, Cure for, uh, the Cure for Life Foundation is the largest fundraiser for brain, brain research in, in Australia. Okay. Then um, I'd like to. Yes. yes uh, furthermore, it's the Bananas of Australia for being here. They're the leading foundation for helping children. So I want to thank them. Chris. Oh, yeah. There you go. Thank you much. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Yes. And of course, we want to show a great thank to the St George Bank, one of the major banks in Australia. So, St George Bank. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Yes. And then I want to thank Chris Newton for a hard working lead. And of course the event manager, Rosal Gowan and the corporate butterfly. And now I want to thank you, um, bring forward Susie Marmari to talk about St George Bank. You want to, yes. Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen, my name is Chris Hardy from St George. It's a real pleasure to be here this afternoon. Uh, you'll be glad to hear that uh, the, the tone of my voice and the, the weather are inextricably linked. Uh, so feel free to laugh at the English weather that I've brought over for you. Um, St George has been supporting charities since 1990, over 700 charities. And during that period we've uh, donated 17 and a half million dollars. We're delighted to be here today uh, to present both to Cure for Life and also to the Bernardo's Foundation. So without further ado, uh, Cure for Life. The Cure for Life Foundation would really like to thank St George. Uh, St George Bank have always tried to uh, improve the health and welfare of children. This is testament to that. Uh, brain cancer kills more kids than any other cancer. It's a terrible disease uh, that kills more children than leukaemia. It's poorly funded and it's money like this, an acknowledgement like this, that we really appreciate and that the children with brain cancer, uh, it gives them hope. Thank you very much. That's uh, really what it's all about. It's about the little guys. And without further ado, I'd like to present a further check from the St George Foundation to Bernardo's.
Thanks very much, Chris, and the St George Foundation. Bernardo's Australia is helping uh, homeless children in, in this very area. We're down on Bay Street uh, to deal with multiple issues that are in their life. Uh, we're right across Sydney, and we can't do it without the fantastic support of uh, great corporations like the St George Foundation. So thank you very much. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Go and have a great day. Feel free to say hi to St George and support all the other storeholders. Thank you very much. It's lovely to be here. Here and stick around because we've got lovely things planned this afternoon. And please put some gold coins in those buckets. So here's to you. Thank you very much. And a celebration to the 30th year of the Glebe Street Fair.